y'all today we're gonna do a wig try on well not try on it's kind of like a review slash demo and i'm gonna be showing you how i style this wig this is from bobby boss i got it from deepatrust.com i love that place i'll definitely have them linked below um i got the anya i believe or anya wig she's a beautiful true blue i'll show you the combs and the actual inside of the cap um she does look like a little shirley simple curls when you first get it but those curls can definitely be brushed out so it is just a one deep sided part so if you want in the middle you can possibly shift your wig but i think it's best to do it with the side part so i'm just going to pull out a little bit of my edges just to give it a more realistic vibe and i'm going to add some gorilla snot um as my little edge gel to kind of slick down my edges i'm going to use some ellie girl pro concealer just to tannin up that part because it does look a little bit a little, a little clear you know but i could have got away with it but i just wanted to add a little bit more concealer to make it like my scalp then i'm going to brush out those little charlotte temple curls to make it more of like a a nice loose flowy voluminous type curls um as you can see it does transition to like a 1b to a nice royal blue but on camera it looks like it's just one solid color but in person I feel like it's more royal blue at the top and like a deeper blue at the bottom I don't know it just looks it looks like that so I'm just gonna brush out everything I love that the bane um, already came like you know cut and layered like everything was layered the only thing I did cut was a little bit of ear tab right there um, just to you know make it a little comfortable around my ear I just stuck a little bobby pin back there and just start to finger comb the hair and tease it with the um with the big comb but I probably wouldn't recommend that because it did kind of like tangle up when I tried to tease it but I noticed that when your wigs get a little bit bigger um within time it looks more realistic especially synthetic wigs it isn't all the way shiny but like my ring light is beaming on it to where it looks shiny all right y'all so the hair that I have on today is nice blueberry dreamsicle hair i'm just loving it it's making me feel a little sexy a little porn starish a little bit but it's cute so the hair that i am wearing is um bobby boss's premium synthetic wig and this is ayana i believe a-n-a-y-a -A or anya ayana anya um she does come in different colors and i got them from divatress.com so divatress is definitely the spot to check out your nice synthetic wigs and human wigs that they do sell they sell like braiding hair products as well so i would definitely check out divatress so um miss anya hold on let me go see if this is the correct name well according to google her name is anaya but i don't know if she's anaya anya I don't know but she's gorgeous so let me get into the specs of this nice unit and I'll definitely show y'all how I actually apply this wig to get it to look this way which this one I felt was less work all I had to do was finger comb add a little concealer to the part pull out little baby hairs and bam this wig is like a slap and go type wig so that is one thing that I do like about it now the length may be an 18 inch standing from here kind of goes to like the part of my stomach so I would say kind of like a little 18 inch um but of course with the curls it looks like it's maybe around a 14 16 um but when it stretches it's basically like a 18 I definitely believe it is 18 hits me on the side yeah I'll go with 18. Now the color I have is TT1B which is the top part where you see mostly like little black and then JWBL now I do not know JWBL but on camera it may look a solid color but when i'm looking at it i feel like it's more of a ombre but i do see mix of it like i feel like it's turquoise and like a nice royal blue up at the top on camera it may look like just one solid color but like when i actually look at the strands it's kind of like it's all mixed in between where you see like an aqua a nice blue it looks like it's like three blues a aqua uh cyan i think that's how you say it and you have a nice royal blue so i'm seeing definitely three colors and of course you have the one b at the top but i'm seeing three different types of blues in here but it's giving off like one complete unit of a nice blue now this is my first time having bobby boss anything i remember bobby boss remy was popular and all that this is my first time having bobby boss and i see why people buy it because this is a nice premium quality synthetic unit i did get a little tangling but the only reason why i have tangling is because i did kind of tease the hair to make it look a little bit more voluminous but i am getting strands 
only piece I did cut was like a little, you know, like a little ear cuff tab kind of thing. But I am noticing some shedding, but I have been fooling around with it, brushing it. I'd rather brush it than tease it with a comb. I recommend getting like a little nice little vented brush and kind of go through your wig with it. Um, and I'll probably take care of little shedding, straggling pieces. But I'm wondering, is it from this little piece being cut? So let's talk about the parting. It is just like the previous wig that I did, the nice, beautiful rose pink kind of color. It is a one single parting. So again, if you do, and it is like a deep part mainly, but if you do want to do a middle part, you can kind of shift your wig to the side. But the way how this is set up, it's kind of like a deep part designated for this side. So I don't know how it will look in a middle part, um, but I definitely like the deep side part look. Cause it's giving like a little Jessica Rabbit, like a little zhuzh around the eye region now let's talk about the texture of the hair now the texture isn't yakky and it isn't silky it's like a mix in between silky but it has like a dull feeling where it's not like a cheap shiny synthetic wig it has a real dull coat but i am liking this wig it sheds yes and the parting, I like the deep side parting. This unit definitely needs a nice deep side part and this bang is giving me life. Now, I didn't have to cut anything but an ear tab. Everything else is like layered and the bang was cut already. I didn't have to cut anything for the bang. So I definitely would recommend Anya, what did Google call it? Anya, whatever. I definitely recommend this wig. Definitely check out divatrust.com and I will have everything linked below. And some similar wigs that probably looks different. You can definitely get this in a different color as well. But I definitely wanted to try this nice little blue color because I haven't had blue hair in a while. So, and this blue is like giving me life. Like I don't have to bleach a wig. I can just put this on and it's already curled and kind of finger comb it into the style that I like it. And I am Gucci. So yeah, hopefully you boos enjoyed this quick little how I slap on my wig and a review. Definitely check out divatrust.com and I will have them linked below and I will see you in the next one. Bye.